I just I can't let this moment go by without saying something. Uh, the Bible tells them, tells you to train up a child in the way that they should go, so that when they get old, they won't depart from it. I think we've done that. And then the Bible tells us to study, to show ourselves approved, working that uh, we need not be ashamed right to divide the word of truth. I think you've done that. And as a village, man, I am just so proud of you. Just so proud of you. Um, just like we have poured into you from a little time all the way up to where you are today. Now is your obligation, wherever you are, wherever the Lord takes you, to pour into your community that same love for God. Because he is your substance, he is your sustainer, and he is the one that's gonna keep you grounded and keep your marriage together. Amen? Amen. Amen. Merciful God, our Father, we thank you for all that we have seen today. Lord, we thank you for this young man who you have put in our lives, Father God, to shape and to mold and to bring to this point. Lord, you knew who he was going to be because you ordained him. You equipped him. You sustained him, Father God. And now's the time for him to run and to prosper and to preach and teach your word to a dying world. Yes. Give him all that he needs, Father God, to be wise, to have the strength that he needs and the courage to do the things that you would have him to do. Lord, as a lawyer, he's going into a world of sharks. Help him to be the bigger shark, Father God, so that you and you alone will be praised. Lord, protect him. Keep him surrounded by your angels. Hold him in the comforts of your loving arms. And when he's going through, give him peace in the middle of the storm. As he prepares, Father God, to take his oath, help him to live up to that oath, Father God. Not so that he can be praised, Father God, but so that you will get the honor and the glory. But more importantly, Father God, so that someone will see you through him come running saying, what must I do to be saved? Because after all, Lord, all we are are your servants trying to tell this dying world that there is still a risen Savior and that his name is Jesus. So help him, Father God. Push him. Don't let him get comfortable where he's at. Continue to have him strive to always be better, to do better, to look better, so that you can get the Lord, it is in Jesus' name that we pray this prayer. Amen. Amen. Amen.